Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Now, the finance bill have exposed a Soros movement as a majority whip in the National Assembly. Osoro is coming out and talking about taxation, which is being done by the current government. Osoro is saying, let me just read it. Osoro to Kenyans, how do you expect roads, electricity and jobs without more taxes? Sasa sahi, ni wanataka kutengeneza barabara. Sahi, ni wanataka kutengeneza electricity. Osoro, you had been my friend for long. And I, I had been watching you on some some of your thought always good and i had been using your 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 reasoning in this platform for several months or years but today i've objected you out today i want to challenge you and i want to tell you but the tax you are talking about based on roads the tax you are talking about based on electricity they were Plotted or drafted years ago, 1990s ago, during Kenyatta's time. They were not drafted right now. I want again to challenge you. The roads in Mugrango, south, where you are coming from, they were not drafted before, they were not draft, drafted in your regime. They were drafted even before you were born. I want to challenge you. The electricity you are using right now in your constituency. They were not drafted now, but earlier. But because our country is based on corruption, room, let me use that term, it's what have made this road not to be completed. It's what have made the electricity not to be completed. It has affected even my area, and I'm not afraid to say that. But when you read or you go to government instruction, you will be shocked seeing that electricity have been done, tick. Road have been completed, tick. So you cannot come out and say that Ruto's government is implementing heavy taxation to create uh, jobs uh, to, 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 uh, to have a turn on electricity, and around that, on road and other things else. This is a wrong move. You are leading this our country into a wrong direction. That is why I keep on saying, if you talk too much, you don't have time to reason. If you talk too much, you don't reason. This is a treason you are causing on Kenyans by paying every taxation. Under which article have they illustrated or indicated that you must pay more taxes in order government to build road, in order government to uh, to uh, have electricity in various parts of the country this is wrong and i want us to dwell much on this break it into analysis so sora have been sent to clarify by william ruto why are they over taxing kenyans but you have clarified it wrongly we are keenly watching you before i carry on ladies and gentlemen if you are watching me for the first time and you've never subscribed to our youtube channel i request you can you do me a favor take a one second and click that notification bell and subscribe to our youtube like our video watch share and give us your opinion and to the members i want to appreciate you so much for your great support to this channel because if it was not your support then this channel could have not reached where it is as at now let's proceed i just want to read quick quick writing here as i'm just displaying it Treasury seek to Kenyan shilling 346.7 billion more through taxes in the bill, the equivalent of 1.9 of Kenyan's GDP towards the Kenyan shilling 3.9 trillion budget. Cabinet Secretary Nyugun Ndugu presented last week. Osoro urges that from the 2024 to 2025 budget, the allocation set aside for salaries and development project is not enough. It says the government needs more from Kenyans, hence the reason for more taxes. Wrong thought. Osoro confused after exposing why UDA is after heavy taxation.
That is what I can say. So the government is having interest on benefiting from Kenyans on taxes more than having interest on listening to Kenyans. Kwani serikali iliundwa aje namna gani? Eh? Serikali iliundwa na serikali ilikuja tu peke yake iseme hapa ni executive hapa ni judiciary ama wa Kenya mkupiga kura mimi sielewi sasa Kenya inaendelea because the government is made with the people and align that and for the people so if it is made with the people why don't these people listen to the people first why don't they listen to those who voted them in it's not all about forcing them to pay taxes it is all about listening to them sawa wananchi hawajakatalia mambo ya tax mimi nalipo ushuru sora nalipo ushuru ruta nalipo ushuru kila mtu analipo ushuru but the question you ought to ask yourself the question you ought to ask yourself e tax inasaidia mkenya nani e tax inasaidia mtu uh, mtu yote nani so the question we ought to ask ourselves but this is a wrong move so it is very clear that the current head of state is having interest on every taxation the current head of state is having most of his uh, opinion ah to tax our Kenya wako na pesa unge tax wa Kenya kama ni for instance achana na road na electricity ya inosoro inasema hizi zilifanywa kitambo sana ilifanywa wakati wa uhuru Kenyatta is only that corruption ndio imefanya zile counties constituencies zingine azijakamilishwa kama constituency yangu Sijui kama sijui kama huyo county government wamepora wame pesa i don't want to know but our main concern is that why heavy taxation why heavy taxation with no reason this is very wrong and that is why kenyans are coming out and condemning this move so sorry you have no challenges you could have come out with a great impact and a resolution on how to solve this situation affecting our country do, do you want to say that people from Turkana should pay heavy taxation what about Mpeketoni what about Lodwa what about Nyanza people wala lipe kidogo ile yenye tulielewana na our forefathers simple and clear kidogo 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 kama ruta anataka ku, kuweka tent ya Kenya ifunike Kenya akuja aseme nimemalizana na hii tax yenu sasa ya kwa barabara hii ingine. nataka kufunika Kenya ndio watu wasiingie ndani tulipe tax hiyo itaelewa <laughs> and we you all the best ladies and gentlemen <laughs> i don't understand what is happening here but i've tried to elaborate it i wish you all the best by the way thank the new subscribers and we are here to be, bring you whatever is taking place in this our country Thank you and bye bye